So, Aretha, there's something I gotta know. Why'd you want to come here? The truth now. I already told you I was hoping that we could finally settle down. I thought that's what you wanted, too. But you knew he was here, didn't you? God, I swear, I was just posting a letter. I went to the Pony Express station, and there he was. Now, you've had a long ride. Why don't you freshen up, get a little rest? As soon as you're ready, I'll show you around. I really think you're gonna like it here. I got four bits. Say you don't make it past the fence post. Are you kidding? I wouldn't put odds on a handoff. Right her up, Cody. Come on, Cody, get up. I'm trying, damn it. Now hold him steady. What in the name of God? Billy Bob, whatever his name is, can do it, and so can William F. Cody. I have to see the first Roman-style exchange in the history of the Pony Express. And the last. Cody! Relax, Teaspoon. I'll make it. Here you go, Cody. You're planning on walking that mail to Big Sandy, but if you ain't out of here in 10 seconds, there ain't gonna be any Sunday cowboy contest, and that goes for the rest of you, too. So there we were in a raging river with the rain <laughs> just pouring down on us, holding on for dear life. Garth was already turning blue, and all of a sudden, kid comes diving in, shouting, hold on, I'm coming. We saved our lives. That's a kid, all right. Never told us you were a genuine, real-life hero. It wasn't a river. It was a creek. Well, you can call it whatever you want, but all I know is I was in over my head. Sounds like you've had quite a childhood. Truth be told, I often wish we could go back. Excuse me, I got chores to do. It was a pleasure meeting you. Teresa, there's something we've been dying to know for a long time now. Maybe you can help us out. He does have a real name, right? Besides the kid. <laughs> Jimmy. Of course he does. I'm surprised he didn't tell you. It's... <clears throat> Do you know? <laughs> it seems to have slipped my mind. <laughs> That was a wonderful dinner. Why, well, thank you. You know, I just can't get over what an amazing coincidence it is. You and Kid running into each other all the way out here. It is amazing, isn't it? <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me. Doretha, look. Whatever you're here for is your business. I just don't want to see him getting hurt. All right? Oh, you two getting acquainted? I was just thanking Mrs. Down for the wonderful dinner. Goodbye. Sorry, Garth couldn't make it. Are you? Your friends are nice. Yeah, I'm pretty lucky, I guess. Yes, me, I'd say they're very lucky to have you. What about that girl, um, the Waves? What about her? <laughs> Come on, kid. I knew the look you were giving her. It was now long ago you gave me that same look. Well, here we are. Well, what do you know? Look who's here. Garth. Good to see you. Don't read the go inside. What? Go inside. Me and the kid here, we just got a little catching up to do, that's all. She's quite a woman, isn't she? Well, isn't she? I better go. 
know, I really ought to be thanking you. If you hadn't taken her money and left when you did, it might have been you who was there when she needed a friend. Maybe you'd be rich, have a fine woman for a wife. <laughs> and I'd be the two-bit hero riding for the Pony Express. <laughs> That's kind of funny now, don't you think? Good night, Garth. Stay away from her, kid. She's mine now. Your friend's never seen him before. Yeah, I know. It's a terrible thing killing a man and not knowing why, but you done what you could, kid. You gotta remember that. Is there something else eating at you? I used to know Garth real well, Teaspoon. And he ain't a bad sort. It's just that he was always the kind that would take what they want, you know what I mean? Yeah. People change. Not Garth. You got the feeling you busted up something more than a simple robbery? I don't know. It could have been. Want me to go out there and talk to him again? No, that's something I better do myself. Thanks, Teaspoon. Kid, uh, you and Doretha, you was, uh... A long time ago. For you, maybe. Be careful, son. to the rescue? Kid, even if she is in trouble, you may not be able to help out. I gotta try. Why? Because she needs me. You sure it's you she needs or just a way out? Never met the man. 